I've got more of a fun story. Uh, a story, I guess, maybe is, is not the right word for it, but a fun little bit, a Twitter bit to uh, finish out tonight's episode on. We're going over to Rice University, and I talked about it earlier in the beginning of the episode. I said, there's a team that did something very funny and very cool, honestly, at fall camp and fall practice where it's getting pretty hot out and the guys are out there for quite a bit of time. And I said, you know what? This, this ain't your mom and pop snow cone truck pulling up the practice afterwards. This is literally a freezer truck coming to fall camp. And I want you guys to just watch this and have the, I'm assuming the same reaction as I did to taking a look at this video. Let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Like, dude, like this just, this cracks me up. And like, I, I, for some reason, I think the thing that stands out to me right away is like, one, they're making this into a grand entrance. What is Buddy doing on the side? You're like, we need a hype crew getting out of the freezer truck. And then these guys are walking out like it's game day. Did we not see a single smile on any of these guys' faces when they're coming down the steps? Do you know how elated I would be if my coach brought a freezer truck to fall camp? I got to go chill in that son of a bitch for a little bit. Just give me like, you know, five, 10 minutes in there. I don't know what fall camp day one was like for the, I believe it's the owls over there at Rice. Apparently it was grueling as hell because there is no joy or emotion on these guys' faces coming out of this thing. I think that is hilarious. But this is the freezer truck they brought out uh, for the owls. I have a couple more pictures that we can uh, talk about here a little bit. Coaches and, and uh, you know different athletic departments continue to be creative in how they handle the heat and things of that nature. And I think this was also kind of like a partnership in, you know, you see the at there for the company. I think this is a lot of like branding for them. So it's almost like, is this a team NIL deal with this like freight company? Is that technically what's going on here? It certainly could be. Look at this thing. They got it parked right next to the field. And it's got to be like, you can see the front there. It looks like there's almost basically a big fat ass air conditioning unit on the front of that. Um, and I did my research, guys. Like the typical freezer trucks of this like freight variety, they can maintain temperatures as low as zero degrees Fahrenheit. Right? I mean, you're transporting frozen goods, but like zero degrees. That's as low as these guys can get. Now, is it zero degrees and those guys walked in there? No, it's not zero degrees. Uh, but the, the fact that it can do that, and if they're coming out and you can see, you can just see the cold, that air just oozing out of it. This is hilarious. This is really cool. We need to see more of this uh, potentially in college football. Um, but it just makes a lot of sense. Shit, if this is an NIL deal for the team, at least like a recognition, kind of a brand deal with this freight company, this transport company, that, you know, kudos to them. Kudos to them for setting this up. I think this is really sweet um, and just cool for the Rice Owls, man. How many guys get to say that they could step in a freezer truck when it got too hot at practice? Now, on the flip side of this, you already know Coach is saying, ain't no way you're complaining about the heat right now. You just got to go stand in a freezer truck for 10 minutes. Now you're going to come out here and complain about the heat, right? I, I can guarantee, I can already see that exchange happening on the football field. Uh, but this is very cool. Nonetheless, had to finish out the episode on that one. So thank you very all. For, uh, thank you very much, all of you. English starts to get tough at the end of these episodes. We've talked enough. Thank you for tuning in. This has been D1 Rejects. I'm Cobra Manson.